Introduction to Engineering 3 Library Instruction This video introduces the Course Guide webpage and a series of library instruction videos developed for Engineering 3. It gives a brief overview of your library assignment and how to access resources listed on the Course Guide webpage. The Engineering 3 Course Guide lists library databases and other resources for your course. It also includes my contact info if you have library-related questions. The shaded box at the top provides links to other sections of the course guide. The first section provides links to the seven brief instructional videos. These videos were developed for this class to both demonstrate relevant resources and to help you complete your assignment. Your library assignment asks you to find both scholarly information and non-scholarly information. You are asked to use a library article database to find a research paper, use the library catalog to find an online book, locate a spec sheet for electronic components, and find a patent. You will also need to cite all four of these items in IEEE format. Your assignment will be more straightforward if you watch all the videos in the order given. From off-campus, you will need to use the VPN to access all library databases, journal articles, and online books. Watch the VPN How to Install and Log In videos for help. The Scholarly Info Journal Articles section of the course guide provides links to the article databases you will need for your assignment. Use the Scholarly Info Books link to access the library catalog. The Non-Scholarly Technical Info link takes you to a section of the course guide that provides links and other info to help you find a spec sheet. Use the links and descriptions given in the Patents section to locate a patent. This is fairly straightforward so there is no instructional video on finding a patent. The How to Cite IEEE Format section provides the resources you'll need to cite an article, book, patent, and spec sheet in IEEE format. If you need additional help, you can email me directly or use the 24-7 chat link at the bottom of the library homepage.